hi welcome to my channel i am sister with a purpose thank you so much for joining me today if you are new thank you for liking the channel and um subscribing all right and divine brothers and sisters what the fuck is up thank you so much for tuning in to another video let's go ahead and tap in and see what spirit has for you thank you so much most high divine relatives divine guides as well as higher self so clear communication and divine protection. These are general tarot messages. Take what applies to your life and what does not. Leave it on the table. All right. I come through and I give you daily generals. I do not do personals. I do not leave my comments on and I do not take any donations because people will give you money to block your blessings and stop your money flow from coming in. I accepted money from somebody. Um, I was going to open it back up, but spirit put it in my heart to not to. I accept if you would like to give me a super chat, you can. Thank you. But I accepted money from someone and she was the last person I ever received money from. And it was like a 333 or a 444 or some shit like that. 555. It was something like that. But that was the last time I had ever seen any money. And for a month after, people had been sending it. If you all have been sending me money, I don't know who has it, but I don't. So I was like, oh, we're going to clear all this shit on up. So it's real. It's some evil people in this world. It's not just divine people who watch me. Okay. This channel is for divine feminine female energy okay if you're a divine feminine masculine you're welcome to join us and watch and um apply the roles how they fit for your life switch them around or whatnot however yeah okay so you just got to be very careful and cautious like who you accept money from okay and that's why i got my comments out it's some evil ass people in this world y'all very evil very 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 fucking evil it's like i enjoy all the beautiful comments and all the love but that evil shit it's like that shit i can't do it i can't do it so yeah i have to stay protected and i gotta protect my energy the nine of wands is the first card i watch the nine of wands here this is a general tarot message all right it's not an energy update it's not an ancestor message it's not a karmic message it is a general tarot reading so it applies to you divine feminine generally we're i'm looking at you okay so the nine of wands and the knight of wands is here i feel like there's two different energies here mm -hmm. okay so it just turned karmic Okay, somebody you don't want to be with. The Four of Cups is here with the Three of Cups. You don't want to be their third party. You don't want to entertain um, BS. But this is someone who's persist persistently in the background been trying to materialize you. Bring you in. Call you in. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like this person could be a Sagittarius very much so. All right. Or a Virgo Cancer. But there's someone or this person hired someone that is in those three sun signs to do the work for them and when i say work i do mean spell work i'm sorry but this is tarot this is what comes out i mean it is what it is <sighs> queen of cups bitch okay someone who's sad maybe the third party cancer sport cancer pisces scorpio i was about to say sportio so maybe this is a scorpio who does sports mm. excuse me or you could be a scorpio who um does sports but there's someone here that was in the background for a long ass time all right with this eight of pentacles could be up to eight years this bitch been doing this it could be somebody's mother or a mother figure like an older aunt or somebody like that capricorn energy capricorn mother oh look queen of pentacles there we got the queen and the king of pentacles so two energies two earth signs or an actual couple all right wow this is but, but why are they doing this if you don't want to be with them this person wanted you in the bedroom with them as a third party okay spirit said no what this person wanted if they have a if they in a relationship what do they want let's find out what do they want if they're in a relationship they wanted a divine connection where they at they feel stuck they want a happy home with you if you are a gemini you could be a gemini they can see your dreams and your wishes coming true they can see the fortune is changing for you you're on the top of the wheel okay and this person like i said sagittarius is that bitch mixing up potions in the background sagittarius capricorn mama to keep somebody stuck so i have two scenarios here there is a masculine that was contracted an outside person to do some type of spell work to get you to come back all right and they did this impulsively now there is another scenario where there are two people whether it's the masculine who you don't want to um 
associate yourself with and their mother or a mother figure this older person they know this doing this spell work or there is a couple now, like this man already has someone who could be a pisces that they feel burdened by pisces cancer scorpio that they feel that they just want to patiently exit left and come towards you for some type of victory but this person had been sleeping with this person is it look look let me tell you something it is what it is i don't mind telling the truth here this person could be pregnant this person could have been giving this person money juggling two households absolutely now they're in despair the nine here with the hermit and then the nine of swords because they had been juggling two households they didn't with this king of cups energy it's like they had been giving their emotion to two different situations and now i feel that it's, it's come full circle for them they're not happy where they at they thought that they would be happy doing this and they're not wow what is the outcome for divine feminine though spirit like what do she needs to hear what is her affirmation for this particular situation if she's enduring this wow did you see how that fell on top of that it's the lovers and the affirmation is if you're a gemini you don't have to be a third party and you don't have to impulsively rush in okay remember that the affirmation for this situation is you have a choice in love can no, no one can bend your will all right it says i release thee i am sowing positive i am business minded and i'm planting my future the way i'm reading the cards okay so it's like you have a choice in love just remember that shit yeah and you're spiritually wise so you already know what's up you the one who got the new beginning and it will be a success always and i'm going to show you the next card because i think this is why this person is in this nine of swords energy because they seen the happy home and they thought it was somewhere else but in reality it was with you ten of cups right here okay if it's a capricorn mama there ain't nothing she can do about it or a capricorn baby mama or practitioner older female whoever the fuck the bitch lacked the skill set to create a happy family dynamic with this person all right wherever they at it's it's, it's tumultuous over there all right all is well this is the reading love and light i bye